Boom! We go up to the moon, everybody. Bullish and bearish. Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is G Trade YouTube channel. In this video, we are going to talk about humble ticker symbol HMBL. In particular, we're going to talk about the chart, the technical analysis, and my personal opinion. If you guys like the content, do subscribe and click the notification button for the latest update. Humble has a great day. We are down 7.32% price at $1.52. Great day after multiple green days. I think that is fine if you take a look at it in a grand scheme of things. As long as we have more green days, then red is fine. Because stock will never go green forever. So it's good to have some consolidation. As of now, we are still above the 50-day moving average and 200-day moving average as well. Uh, but we are flirting with the 50-day moving average. So we just got to wait and see. And if you watch my previous videos, I drew this particular line over here. I felt that it's a little bit more conservative uh, to have to set this particular line because um, you see touch, touch, and then, okay, if you guys can see. Okay, so, um, so as you guys can see over here, it touches this one, two, three, and then it's going to be around here. So I felt that this is a little bit more conservative, uh, but then as the day goes by, uh, I felt that hey, there is this ascending level of support. It is a little bit steep, therefore I keep this particular line. And true enough, this line couldn't withstand it, withstand any red day, so I'm just going to take it out. So if you look at it, it's, it is fine, right? We have this bounce off, so sort of like bounce off, and then we have a good like flying we were flying and then it bounced back up back up back down here so and then pre-market is up here 160 something so uh, if you ask me i do hope that we are respecting this ascending level of support instead so what i mean by this is we have one bounce two bounce three bounce four bounce and we just got to wait and see whether there is a confirmation. And so that's what I want to say here. And of course, I'd like to mention that yesterday, our brother Eric Erickson actually mentioned about uh, this could potentially be a cup and handle formation. You may be right on the pullback, but I wonder if cup, a cup and handle is forming. So that's what Eric said. So in case you are wondering what is a cup and handle, so... Let me share with you why it's cup and handle before I draw in our chart. So a cup and handle formation is basically uh, it goes down and there is this uh, it start to you know bounce back up and then there is this pullback, right? There is this pullback and then it start to moon again. So that is a cup and handle formation. It looks like a cup, isn't it? Uh, so how does it relate to our chart? So so if you take a, so if you take a look at this our chart it kind of resembles our a cup and handle formation whereby it starts to go up and there is this drawback so again up I hope you guys can see then there is this uh, here so the next point what's gonna happen that's why I say Friday is quite crucial because it could potentially bring us to moon if Friday everything goes well we could potentially see this or maybe not so steep like maybe probably like probably follow this but this is a cup form and handle formation but i also like to you know highlight to everybody bullish and bearish point of view so um you guys can can read pause and read this up what is a cup and handle formation um but also we we need to be careful because cup and handle formation it works both way both ways you take a look at this it, there is this cup and handle formation forming and then it, there is a drop but it could potentially drop even further. Uh, this person, probably a little bit more bearish, he said, reality is a different story. So we just got to wait and see uh, how Friday is going to play out. As much as I'm bullish, as much as I'm bullish on humble, I don't want to, uh, as you, my viewers, are very valuable, I'd like to share, uh, share with you guys to be careful, right? Because uh, this, all this chart, it is legit right as you can see from the resistance line and stuff that we drew over here we take reference from this and true enough it couldn't break the resistance line and then it dropped so it is um it is quite powerful so um this kind of handle formation we just gotta watch very carefully whether what's gonna happen next will it moon or will it start to have this downtrend again so we we don't know so um set your set your stop losses 
set your stop losses that's what i'm saying uh, if you guys are in uh, positive like most of my viewers uh, if you watch my videos in the beginning and those in my telegram group chat you guys are in what 60 i mean because yesterday it dropped right so 60 percent 70 percent gain then you might want to you know see how you're going to play around this um maybe you perhaps cash out some of it 25 percent 30 percent and then you just got to wait and see what's going to happen next for any confirmation uh, Friday will be a good day to to observe. Yeah, so that's about it for me. Okay, uh, I hope you guys like the video. Do comment down. How do you guys think? What do you guys think of this cup and handle formation? The potential of it, whether it is, um, whether it is you know this kind of cup and handle formation, this kind of cup and handle formation. So we just gotta. Um, just gotta see. So you guys uh, leave them down in the comment section. What do you guys think? How Friday will be like? Will it be a uh, buy the rumors, sell the news, or will it be a mass, massive, massive, right? massive blast up to the moon? A cup and handle formation, confirmation, and boom, we go up to the moon, everybody. So yeah. So let me know and do subscribe and click the notification button so that you don't miss any latest updates. If nothing else, I hope you guys uh, trade safe and stay safe in this pandemic. Bye.